We're doing one of a few many things here this evening. Yeah, we got this going too. I've been bragging about a little glass of bourbon for some time. I think it's high past time that we have one. It's celebration time right now. I guess maybe I don't have a whole lot in life, which I'm, I'm okay with. So it's a celebration evening this evening. So we're doing one of a few different things. We're, we're having a little glass of bourbon. Uh, what do I got in here? Um, I took some advice from, uh, uh, I'd like to say, a, a fellow, uh, fellow YouTube friend of mine. I think I can say that. Uh, Will Sowers, Sowers Cattle Company. Uh, this is Pendleton. And I got to be honest with you, it's uh, it's pretty damn fair, pretty fair. <sighs> More importantly, right now, what we're doing is I want to wish everybody a very merry Christmas, a day late. Uh, sorry about the day late. I usually take very great pride in uh, putting on a nice little uh, Merry Christmas uh, YouTube video on Christmas morning. Get it uploaded real quick. <coughs> um, no complaining. Um, things have been pretty rough around here. Hence the reason for a little celebration. It's calm as a cucumber. You can't hear anything, can you? Except for me mumbling. It's over. The storm is over. She been hell. So that, and I'm going to show you what this storm did here. Comes down to it, we're lucky. Uh, snowfall, snow pre precipitation uh, is almost kind of funny. It was a joke compared to what we were supposed to get. We got lucky uh, up north of here. They did not. Uh, pretty devastating. Uh, one thing that uh, was not funny around here was our western winds. Our winds were just god-awful nasty. So you mix in a small amount of snow with, of course, the west direction and all that open land. Um, it, it, it proves to be... W wind chill on this farm is a killer. I know it is everywhere. But the way this farm is set up and, and blah, 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 wind chill is just an absolute disaster. <coughs> so we're going to go for a little walk. Merry Christmas. Huh. Ooh, that's fair. So yeah, we're going to go for a little walk here. I'm going to kind of show you what happens here in this yard. When we have a uh, unfavorable high wind from the west. So let me switch hands here because I also have my beer because uh, I'm, I'm that coordinated. Right here, not a big deal. Hey, kitty. Kitty, what are you doing? Huh? You don't, you don't know what you're doing. No, you ain't got the answers. You ain't got them. You think you do. I know this isn't that bad, okay? But trust me, it had to be worked on a couple days in a row, three, four times a day. Uh, it gets to the point where, you know, it, it's... Well, there was a couple points where it was impassable. Oh, I immediately regret not wearing gloves. It's actually not that cold. <coughs> but a lot of this runway we just went down, of course, gets pushed. Obviously, I'm going downhill. It gets pushed into this area here. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you can even, you can see some bare pasture ground for crying out loud. We got some snow, don't get me wrong. But with that wind that carried it this way, uh, just just awful. Uh, I kind of like to try and keep this runway clear, which doesn't do me any anything. I, I just I like to keep it clear, 
if it gets too damn bad, I'm not going to. Then, of course, this uh, this gets pretty bad. It doesn't take much for this uh, little runway here to uh, come up with a foot worth of uh, blown snow, which naturally gets pushed out that way, and you can see that fair size bank. So, yeah, she's uh, it's over. Just makes everything more difficult. Uh, you know, that strong western wind. Uh, if I had to guess, I think our worst wind chill temperature, I want to say it was 20, 21, 22 below, something like that. Which isn't the end of the world. But when it hits that western end of the barn, no matter how protected I have the barn, those uh, those water cups they freeze up. Now you're running heaters. Uh, it just she's been a bear. And then you give me wind temps like that, mixed in with already a cold barn. Uh, I chose not to clean the barn two days past it needing to be cleaned. That. Uh, that wasn't very nice. I ended up having to, I was almost in emergency mode. I ended up having to clean the barn yesterday morning, Christmas morning. <coughs> but I'm a little weird like that. I find a little honor in that and uh, made it fun. As fun as you can anyway. Folks, that's about it. Uh, just wanted to stop in, say Merry Christmas. Things are good here. It was a hell of a two and a half days or so. It really was. I know a lot of other people have it a lot worse. Uh, I've been seeing some social media stuff. And I mean, even immediately here by me up north. North of me was not pretty, not pretty at all. With the high winds and then heavy, heavy snow. We got lucky. So, uh, no complaining, but, uh, yeah, two and a half days of, uh, shoot a little rough, but it's over. So what does a guy like myself do to celebrate, uh, this special moment? <laughs> well, you, you've seen some of it, uh, that I've got a nice warm house this evening. Uh, I gotta, I gotta keep up on some, uh, some paperwork, which is not a hindrance to me. And then uh, I have some uh, beef tenderloin out with, uh, if you want me to get fancy, I'll get fancy with you. Uh, beef tenderloin with uh, rice, uh, mushrooms, and onions. So, yeah, it's a, uh, it's a celebration. Christmas Day went fantastic yesterday. Of course, I was busy, which is fine. I'm always busy. Uh, but uh, then, of course, it came time to celebrate Christmas and the family gathering like always was just uh, uh, fantastic very special um, you know it, it starts after everybody's done with church you know because there's there's some siblings you know with the families that come from they're about 30 45 minutes away so we kind of all get, start gathering by about 1 1 30 and then of course it's gift openings with a, with a, a late lunch uh, early dinner and, uh, you know, it's time for me to come back and do chores. And then that evening, uh, we all get together down at the basement of my mom and dad's and uh, just uh, continue to celebrate Christmas with some, uh, with some games and uh, just uh, great, great family fun. Very lucky. Um, uh, yeah, I enjoyed it immensely, as always. And uh, life is good. Life is hectic. But life is good. I hope everybody else is doing okay. Hope you had a really nice holiday season. Merry Christmas season, excuse me. And uh, yeah, and a New Year's to come. So I got to start thinking about my additions and subtractions for New Year's. 
because yes, I'm one of those people. I'm not saying I always follow it, but I, I, I give it a I give it an effort. Will, thank you. Pretty fair stuff. We need to share a bottle one night. Oh. That's it, folks. Me and Kitty. Hey, Kitty. What are you doing, Kitty? You got the answers? Huh? No, you ain't got no answers. You don't have the answers. You think you do, but you don't. You don't. Spoiled rotten little baby, right? Good kitty. Good kitty. That's it, folks. I got to get going. Merry Christmas. Oh, that's, that's kind of pretty. I just said pretty. Merry Christmas. Happy New Year yet to come. We're going to try and put on a video or two here before the New Year's comes and uh, go from there. Um, <coughs> I see some live streams coming up. We usually, uh, we usually do so here after the New Year, and uh, we'll go from there. That's it. I can't mumble on anymore. We're going to talk to you sooner and later, and again, a very Merry Christmas.